Isn't God wonderful? Oh, we keep us. Hallelujah. For this time. Hallelujah. I say hallelujah. Bless your name. Eternal God and our Father. Just one more time, God. We are so thankful, God, that we can come into your presence in the name of Jesus. God, we say thank you for the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. And as we come this morning, God, God, we invite you in, God. Hallelujah. Have your way, God. Move and do whatever you will, God. You are the potter. We are the clay. In the name of Jesus, deliver, set free, God. Heal the miracles. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Remember your servant, God, as you enter in, God. Pray, God, that you will continue to bless your servant. In the name of Jesus, above all God, hallelujah, God, send the anointed, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your blessing. God, we praise you. We lift you up, Lord. We give you glory because you're worthy. Hallelujah. Oh, Good morning, Pastor Seaman. Good morning, saints. Please remain standing for the reading of the Holy Word. This morning's scripture is taken from 1 Samuel chapter 17, verses 38 through 47. And here beginneth the reading of God's Holy Word. And Saul armed David with his armor, and he put an helmet of brass upon his head. Also he armed him with a coat of mail. And David girded his sword upon his armor, and he essayed to go forth, for he had not proved it. And David said unto Saul, I cannot go with these, for I have not proved them. And David put them off him. And he took his staff in his hand and chose him five smooth stones out of the brook and put them in a shepherd's bag, which he had, even in a scrip. And his sling was in his hand, and he drew near to the Philistine. And the Philistine came on and drew near unto David, and the man that bare his shield went before him. And when the Philistine looked about and saw David, he disdained him, for he was but a youth and ruddy and of a fair countenance. And the Philistine said unto David, Am I a dog that thou comest to me with staves? And the Philistine cursed David by his gods. And the Philistine said to David, come to me and I will give thy flesh unto the fowls of the air and to the beasts of the field. Then said David to the Philistine, thou comest to me with a sword and with a spear and with a shield. but I come to thee in the name of the Lord of hosts, the God of the armies of Israel, whom thou hast defied. This day will the Lord deliver thee into mine hand, and I will smite thee and take thine head from thee, and I will give the carcasses of the host of the Philistines this day unto the fowls of the air and to the wild beasts of the earth, that all the earth may know that there is a God in Israel. And all this assembly shall know that the Lord saveth not with sword and spear. For the battle is the Lord's. And he will give you into our hands. May the Lord add a blessing to the reading of his most holy word. Good morning, church. Let us repeat the Apostles' Creed. I believe in God the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Ghost, 
born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, dead, and buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sitteth at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the quick and the dead. I believe in the Holy Ghost, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. When we say the Holy Catholic Church, we are not referring to the Roman Catholic Church, but the Church Universal. When we say he descended into hell, we mean he went into the grave and he did not stay there. Amen. Hallelujah.